Once rich but now broke, 12 Nigerian celebrities and footballers who went from grace to grass. In today's video, let's look at 12 Nigerian celebrities and footballers who went broke after making millions from their careers. Before we get started, I challenge you. You have to click on subscribe and activate notifications. Check the option all. But you have to do that in less than 5 seconds. You got it? And if you can, write in the comment section hashtag ACBKingTV. Alright, with that out of the way, let's get started. Number 12. Efe Ejeba. I've been the drive for Bariga, but not like the struggle to work on Monica. Winner of Big Brother Niger Season 2, Michael Ife Ejeba, born February 25th, 1993, is a native of Delta State but was born and brought up in Just Plateau State. Ife, also known as Ife Money, is a Nigerian singer, media personality, songwriter, and rapper. In 2017, he won the Big Brother Niger show. He attained his primary and secondary school education in Jos and is a graduate from the University of Jos Plateau. He won 20 million naira from the Big Brother Nigeria season 2, but later went broke due to mismanagement. Number 11. African China. Born as Shinagorom T. Onoa, but famously known as African China, China was born in a ghetto called Orile in Lagos. He's very creative, skillful, and talented as a singer, while he described as a crisis crooner who sings sentimental songs in a soft, low voice. In the early 2000s, African China was the hottest singer in Nigeria and Africa at large. He made a lot of money, but he, however, went broke years later. He did not completely go broke anyway. African China is the proud owner of a salon named Chinatown Unisex Beauty Salon, located in Festac Town, Lagos. Number 10. Kalestin Babayaro Kalestin Babayaro was a legend at left back of Chelsea and the Nigerian Super Eagle squad. He was fun to watch and ladies fought because of him in London because he had money to squander. However, the former Chelsea star outlooks have raised great concern and his colleague are asking if he has gone broke, but he denied being broke still, despite earning a massive £25,000 during his peak he was declared as bankrupt at a court in Craydon in 2010. Number 9. Lord of Ajasa Lord of Ajasa is widely referred to as the pioneer of Yoruba rap in Nigeria, a title that has often been contested by fans of Nigerian rap Olamide Adedeji, popularly known as Olamide. His hit singles include Milo, Ara Awe, Otia and Lefe Nuso, which features nice. Ajasa, back then, was a trending Yoruba hip hop star who raps in Yoruba dialect. Ajasa emerged into the limelight with a track titled Mailo. Lord of Ajasa was reported to be critically ill and needed funds to undergo operation on 15th June 2019. Number 8. Ifai Ezokeke. He rose to fame after his role in the 1999 movie Conspiracy, where he got the name Ugo Shave. If you are conversant with the child star that were made in the 1990s in Hollywood, then Ezokeke's name will ring a bell. He took a Facebook photo shared by his colleague Diawait Ikwechuku in 2020 for everyone to know that the child star has been down with illness. Number 7. So E. His celebrity status was like a flash in time. The So E Baba De Hear was a hit intro to every song when So E was still famous and known for entertainment. He left Colossal Entertainment Night Limited to start his own record label, but that was the beginning of the end for him as his record label never went international. He later married an older woman who many believed to have contributed to his bankruptcy. Number 6. Sion Ekbegbe, Nollywood filmmaker Sion was caught stealing 9 iPhones in Computer Village, Lagos. Aside from stealing iPhone, Sion was caught and arrested for defrauding some bureau change operators of 40 million nairas between 2016 and 2017. It could either be that he was broke or it was his village people that pushed him to do it. Number 5. Taribo West The story of the Nigerian prominent footballer Taribo West, diminishing fame is heartbroken, but it comes with lessons too. 
The former Nigerian international footballer made a great name for himself as a tough crackler. With a hair you could see in the pitch. He once played for AC Milan, Inter Milan, Derby County and many much more. In his prime, he partied and enjoyed life and then made a very bad investment in his marriage and all he acquired went down the drain. However, in 2014, he became a pastor and founded his own ministry. Now that he has found salvation, he preaches on popular streets in Lagos and is now a soul winner and his name has been changed to Pastor West. Number 4. Wilson Oruma The famous footballer who played at the top in the French league went from grace to grass and suffered a partial mental breakdown. Oruma, who was among the younger Super Eagle under 17 FIFA World Cup of 1993, was a magical midfielder during his prime. Wilson was sadly a victim of a toxic society. The midfielder invested a large sum of money, like 2 million nairas, in a pseudo oil and gas business with a proper consultant because he was doing the business with the clergyman and he went broke and lost all. Number 3. Marvelous Benji again, 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 I Give it to He started out with Kenny's Music. The record label that once projected and promoted Nigerian musicians like Two Face Indivia, Sound Sultan, Lagbaja, OJB, Azadus, and so on. The Ajegunle based artist, who became a household name after the release of his popular song Soul, while still with Kenny's music, since left Kenny's music, seems to have jumped from frying pan to fire. Since the singer left the record label in a controversial manner, he has struggled to remain in the limelight but since his disengagement from the record label. Number 2. Blackface you look so good to me. Your beauty, you me, baby. Amedo Agustin Obiabo, known by stage name Blackface Niger, or just Blackface, is a Nigerian dancehall raga reggae singer and songwriter. Blackface was a founding member of the Nigerian band Plantation Boys that he formed in 2000 with Two Face and One Face. Rumors have it that Two Face stole the lyrics of his all time classic hit song African Queen from Black. While Two Face succeeded in his musician career, Blackface, however, did not really make it to the top as later went broke and did not have money to invest in his career. Number 1 Baba Fryo Baba Fryo, born Friday Igwe, is a veteran Nigerian singer from Ajegunle. He is known for releasing street songs. His most popular song in Nigeria was titled Dem Go De Pose, which released in the late 1990s. He sang with a popular Nigerian music style known as Galala. After making so much money from music, he later went broke. That said, that is where we will pack our bags for today's video. If you enjoyed the video and found it entertaining enough, do all to give it a thumbs up and let us know your thoughts about this topic in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of our new uploads.